everyone. My name is Catalina Gonzalez. I'm a Stampin' Up! demonstrator. Welcome to video number 16 of my quick and easy Monday card. And today I'm going to be making this really pretty and cute card. And there's a couple of things that I need to let you know. Um, I'm going to, uh, the stamp sets that I'm using are, let's see, the flower shop and the sorry for everything this one is really a pretty a scent it has a lot of pretty sentiments because you can use it when um you've lost a friend or a friend have lost a family somebody has lost a family member or someone is struggling and there's a lot of nice uh sentiment like i really like this one i wish i could make everything better or um, so I'm sorry. I'm very sorry for your loss. You can combine these together, and um, and I'm just uh, this. It's really nice. I really like this one and um, and these two together. So let's go. And the other thing that I'm going to be uh, doing, focusing on this week, there is a color combination, the color combos, and these are the colors that I'm going to be focusing on this week. The Whisper, Wh the Whisper White, the Smoky Sled, the Melon Mumbo, and the Bermuda Bay, and it looks really pretty together. Um, at first I wasn't sure how it was going to look, but as I started putting the cards together, I realized that it looks really nice and as you can see in this card I love how that uh, Bermuda Bay stands out and uh, with the melon mumbo it, it all looks really pretty um, some of the and as the inks that I'm going to be using are Smoky Slate melon mumbo and of course the Bermuda Bay See, I'm going to need a little piece of paper, so because when I stamp, uh, when I randomly stamp these flowers here, I'm going to stamp off the uh, the card. So I need to make sure I need a pa paper so I can protect my table. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and get started. Um, first of all, the Whisper White cardstock that I'm using, I already have it folded is uh five and a half by eight and a half and i scored it at four and a quarter okay and let me use the bone folders again there we go that's better okay um so what i did i'm going to start off with the smoky slate um let's see here And I'm going to randomly stamp this flower right here in Smoky Sled. And I'm going to stamp three of those flowers. And I'm going to stamp this one off the card. I think you can see it there. Just hold it a little bit and rock it a little bit. I'm also going to stamp another one right here and the third one over here okay let's close this one for a little bit now I'm going to use the Bermuda Bay and I am going to stamp, I'm going to use, as you can see, this one has uh, six different flowers. And the one I used first was the uh, Smoky Slit with this one. And now I'm going to use this one right here. And I'm going to stamp that in uh, Melon Mumble. And I'm just going to stamp it right here in the middle of those other flowers. That's going to look so pretty. Okay. And let's go ahead and close this one. Now, let's use the Bermuda Bay. And let me move this a little bit up so you can see that better. Okay. 
I am going to stamp. What I try to do when I have letters and um, uh, sentiments like this, I try to align my stamp as, as straight as I can so it'll make it easier for me to, when I stamp, hopefully if I can just, I, I use this to align uh, my letters. I'm hoping that this will be straight. So let's see. Let's try that out. I'm going to stamp it a little bit down. I'm going to have to stand up, but I'm going to stamp it a little bit down. Uh, hopefully it'll be straight. Let's see. Let's give it a try. Hold it and rock it a little bit. There we go. And now let's stamp... Um, the this piece right here says true sorry to hear you're not feeling well so let's do that in smoky sled okay okay let's see sorry. um there we go Is it this way Make sure I have it right. Yeah, okay. All right. Let's stamp that right below that. Sorry. There you go. All right. Isn't that pretty? I love, you know, when I saw this color combination, the first thing that came to me was Hawaii for some reason. It, it's just so pretty. And I hope you liked it. Oh, and let me go ahead and show you my cards for the red, the other two cards for the week. Here we have oops, the card that I posted on Sunday. Isn't that pretty? I used the uh, smoky sled as the card base and I did use an embossing uh, folder for this one and as you can see I randomly stamped the flowers these flowers right here on a piece of paper and um, and then this one it looks so pretty that's the one for Sunday and the casing Tuesday is right here isn't that pretty? What I did here, I took a, a long piece of paper and I used the sponge stoppers to, to just get all those colors there. And then, uh, and, uh, and so, and then I put that behind. So, it, so I hope you like it and I hope you had fun today. Thank you so much for stopping by. Bye.